Yo, what is up guys? This is Mars Man and today we're doing a Tyler the Creator um, beat breakdown type beat breakdown how the tricks of the trade, sounds to use, software use, VSTs um, and yeah, we're gonna break it down now, I'll jump straight into it First of all, we got this electric piano sound which I, I start the song off with this, I wasn't going to go for a Tyler type of track. I was just going for like a little bit of a slow, soulful joint. I was like, damn, this sounds so jazzy and Tyler-ish. I was like, man, I'm, I'm have to make something with it. So here we go with the original chords. So you can see we've got major ninths going on. With the bass notes there, we add a lot to it. So having, when you got an electric piano, adding the bass notes that are just going up and down, just jumping in, that kind of thing, gives it a funky feeling. Um, jazz it up too, you have the right notes. Um, and obviously on the second half, we have some higher notes as well. And you can see these little, I forgot, I forgot what these are called, but you know, when it goes, bling, you know, it sounds fucking good. Um, so we'll move on to the next next part of this. And we'll just keep layering it up. So. <coughs> As you can see, there's a little fall down the scale here. So with the organ, um, just on the second half, gives it that extra, you know, glitter on top. Okay, so I will move on to this. It's just a choir, very quiet when all the instrument stuff are in it, you can barely hear it, but just adds a little bit extra. Let it go through. Not playing the exact same, but just notes in the chord. Um, kind of give it that feeling as if some you've just got three people doing it rather than just like copying the chord. It, it gives it more of a real feeling, in my opinion, even though it does sound fake. So here we go. We got Cynthia. Now this is a sound that makes it as Tyler as you can get, in my opinion. Just that. It's almost gorillas as well, but um, that plucky synth bass, bass, synth sound, um, just on top of it, bow, 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 that kind of thing, just get, I don't know, I don't have to explain the feeling that it gives, but it certainly gives Tyler the Greater. Um, we'll move on to the violins now. And by the way, these are all in Analog Lab, that's why I haven't been breaking them down, but I will quickly now go through... Um, which so that it's candlelight um, piano there um, for the organ is the cathedral organ um, for the vocals just the la la sound on it and analog lab for the, the last one just solo solo lead new classic um, yeah I mean fire sound and here we go to the violins this is where we get some different software so BBC Symphony Orchestra is free. You can get that for free. I think you have to sign up and they have to accept you. It doesn't take long. They accepted me. Um, yeah, this is the standard violin. Standard that you can get. Just the no effects changed or added. Um, yeah, even on here. You can see I've not got much going on. We'll get further into that later. But let's listen to it. I'll show you the notes I did. Just brings a lot to the chorus section. I mean, look, you can go wrong, it's beautiful, and obviously Tyler loves that kind of stuff too. Um, uh, Keithy, I didn't really break, I didn't mention this too much, but um, the switching between chords with the passing chord just being the minor below it. So going from A minor ninth to G sharp minor ninth. Um, quickly into the major chord is just like as jazzy as you can get really you know it's a really nice sound if that's what you're going for it's a really nice sound so we'll get into the bass now you know ignore that but just a muted guitar but add a chorus on it. it makes it sound thicker larger and we just put a little sub bass below it Obviously, you can more feel it than hear it. But 
then we have this drum break. So, um, all these drums uh, are solely, you can find them, I've got an entirely created drum kit, um, but I just added it to get a feeling. I was like, I want this to stay, and you'll hear why, because I think it sounds amazing. See, it almost kind of ends up having like a, although it's kind of, a, it is a happy sounding, jazzy sounding uh, beat. I think with the, the synths on top, it kind of gives a little bit of an evil feeling. Then we'll move on to verse section. All you have to do is take the instruments out, but it, I just have um, the original keys, but you hear our changes, you know. You just imagine coming in, just you know, Tyler spitting something or whatever. Um, just letting it play. But these kind of uh, these kind of beats, it's they're intro. They don't necessarily fall inside of like a specific scale, um, which you know a lot of jazz doesn't. You know, um, you can see here. This is a was it diminished or augmented chord of a ninth to, as the last chord? It seems weird, and you could say it sounds weird, maybe, but um, that's jazz, man. And, um, you know, if you know, if you're tapped in, if you um, listen to that kind of stuff, you'll understand why it sounds fire. But, yeah, this is all I'm going to do today for this video. Um, I really hope you enjoyed. Um yeah, like and subscribe, comment for what you want next. I'm working on more stuff. I'm trying to get more uh, tutorials out there, you know, trying to move forward and uh, do better things. So peace out, guys. Love you.